educate our students in all areas of process and control, right from removing valves and uh, installing transmitters to commissioning uh, transmitters and points and confirming that all aspects of our process plant are running. A control system is anything that controls the process, which uh, the end result is a manufactured item, be it oil, gas, robotics, control systems for cars, or for assembly lines, for, I mean, basically instrumentation and control rule the world. This is a process plant that was actually built uh, from donations from Hibernia. In actual fact, uh, it's a $1.2 million plant. What we do here is we do everything they do offshore and onshore on all land and uh, offshore base rigs. All they do is separate their product. They separate it into four items, which is gas, water, oil, sediment. Obviously the sediment is treated and then you know dealt with. The oil is stored in the tanks for the tankers or the FPSO or the gravity-based system. Gas then is also stored, a certain amount of gas is stored for running all the electrical systems because they have a, a dual mode system out there. They can run on natural gas or diesel. And then the water is re-injected, is treated and re-injected to keep pressure up. And they also re-inject what gas they do not use because, I mean, again, it's, a, it's just a storage tank. The reservoir is still then just turned into a storage tank for gas. This particular process plant is the third in Canada. There's two in Alberta, one Pitts, which is the guys who de designed our plant. Those who graduate from this uh, program will enter into an apprenticeship agreement with the uh, Department of Education to ultimately uh, end up as a journey person in the instrumentation and control technician industry. The instrumentation and control technician program at entry level would be nine months from September to June. The student then would, would go out and look for work and become indentured with the Department of Education as an apprentice and they would come back for three more blocks of training with course training happening on the job site as well. 